Okay, test loop two, running beta build 8.1. Now turn left onto Plum Canyon Road. Which is 2020.48.35.7. Okay, it's gonna have to creep forward. I got lots of traffic coming from the left. I cannot see to the right yet. Okay, I can see to the right in one car and then it's clear. It can go now. It's got a car coming from the left turning. It should go. Little hesitation going. It's still clear. There it goes. It made the decision to proceed. There we go. Okay, well, I let that one play out. I'll just send that one in because I didn't do any interventions. Little hesitant to proceed even though it was clear, but I'm guessing it was doing a second, uh, a thorough check for right any oncoming cars before it made the commitment to go. Now turn right onto Golden Valley Road. Creeping forward, okay, now. I'm encouraging it to go because it got itself into a position where it was going to be in the way of that. Uh... See, it shouldn't be getting in the left lane either. I need to do it right up here. I need to send that in. See, now it's getting back over. Okay, now it is because it was waiting for that intersection. Now turn right onto Getter Lane. traffic cones definitely got a little smoother at doing that previously it would come to a complete stop while it looked now turn left onto Saxama circle okay now we'll head back do a manual u-turn back to my start point Now turn right onto Getter Lane. Now turn left onto Golden Valley okay. Road. Okay, we're clear to the left, and it's creeping to luck, and we are clear to the right. Made the decision to go. It's nice and open, so no rush, and there we go. I'm gonna send that one in. The reason I'm sending that one in is it was kind of slow, it had the room, but uh, it should, in my personal opinion, go a little faster once it's committed to the turn. In 500 feet, turn left onto Plum Canyon Road. Okay, now it doesn't now turn left onto seem Plum to recognize Canyon that it could be in this left turn lane. So it gets into the far left, makes the turn, and immediately gets into the right lane. So send that in, because it should stay in that right lane. While technically nothing wrong with this, it does have some unnecessary lane changes. So now it's going to immediately signal right and then move over eventually. Still have a speed bug here. The speed limit is actually 50 right here. In 1,000 feet, turn right. some hesitation on moving over, but it's got time. I'm just going to send that in. Okay, now I'll let go and let it handle this. There's no one coming, so I'll let this play out. See, this is the weaving that's happening. Send that in. And there we go, test loop two.